Hello YouTube, this is another Fabu online tutorial. So basically, I had a Roku stick installed at my old place and I lost the remote because they're very small and they're hard to find. And I've tried every app I could to try to access the Roku remote, but you need to be on the same Wi-Fi network. And when I moved, I currently switched uh, internet service providers, so I didn't have access to the old network. I've looked through all these blogs and everything I could, and the only solution I found was to go and find your um, your default. IP address for your uh, network and what you're gonna do is you're gonna look you're gonna go to CMD you're gonna type in IP config um, and then just hit enter and you should actually get everything showing up here and what you're gonna do is you're gonna look for the default gateway and you're gonna copy that number down okay not my number, but you're going to do it on your PC when you're connected to your Wi-Fi network. And um, what you're going to do is you're going to go to that number in your web browser. And you're going to enter it. You're going to log in. And you're going to see all your information. Uh, it depends on what service provider you're at. But mine basically looks like this. And uh, what you're going to do is you're going to go to settings. And as long as you know your old SSID and the Wi-Fi password, you're going to enter that new information into your, um, your service. So you're going to change your SSID and your serial number, aka Wi-Fi. And you're gonna save it using your old WEP password. And that will allow you at your new place with your new router to trick the Roku stick into allowing access for you to download the Roku remote app connect to it using the old information on your new router and you will be able to control it using your phone or your tablet or whatever um, I know this video is not very instructional but I just wanted to give you guys kind of a heads up that's the only way I have found to actually do it and Either that or you're going to go spend 30 bucks to get a new remote for your Roku. Um, or even you'll have to buy a brand new Roku. Because I don't know. They just made it that way, I guess. But anyways, thank you for watching my video. This has been another Fabu Online production. And I currently won't be providing too much feedback. As I just wanted to make this video really quick to help you guys out. 